So over the next one year, I, I believe their meetings are going to be held of, in 55 different locations yeah. across the country. No, yeah. no trivial uh, number. Can you give a flavor of what are these, what are these locations, uh, how were they chosen, what, what, what should we expect in these places? So we worked in partnership with the state governments because after all, mm -hmm. uh, it's the state governments play a very mm -hmm. critical role. The Prime Minister mm -hmm. spoke to all the chief ministers mm -hmm. uh, and said that they should all actively participate. They should do their own uh, competitions. And therefore, we've tried to pick up the best talent for cultural shows. All the states are actively involved. We picked up key areas. Every state there will be a meeting. Every mm -hmm. union territory there will be a meeting. There are key areas. Uh, several uh, places where there is major. So give meeting. us that, some of the names where. So, say for instance, Kumaragam in Kerala, okay. uh, in the backwaters, Udaipur, Varanasi, uh, Mumbai, uh, look at uh, uh, Nagaland, Manipur, Andaman, so that's, that, that's quite something. Yeah, yeah. You know, every, every places place. like Manipur, for example, yeah, would yeah. not normally. Absolutely. Not mm. normally hold, yeah, be hosting yeah. anything. So yeah. this is this is going to be quite. Yeah. So this experiment. is a pan India movement. This is really about uh, making every citizen of India aware of the significance and importance mm. of what India is doing for G20 and how India has taken leadership position in the world, and that this is the first time that India is setting the agenda for the world. Mm.